Hey guys, welcome back to the Pokemon Fire Red Randomized Nuzlocke. My name is Strayed, and we're gonna go back and find all the trainers that I skipped over to get to Celadon, because I was angry. And we're going to wreck, wreck some face. And then we're going to wreck some face. Oh, actually, why would I use that road when I just got the, the tea? So I went over to that old lady's house and picked up tea. So I could do this. Uh, glug, glug. Jeez, how big are these teacups? Uh, Alright, cool. So this, <clears throat> Saffron City is the city that has been blocked off and I've had to take different paths to get through. I could pick up the TM for, for Psychic. Not going to. It's there though. Cool. I also, okay, so I also looked up some things. I've been uh, waiting for Hero to get up to level 25 to get Aerial Ace, so I don't have to use the TM. Uh, Nyx does evolve at level 30. <clears throat> Excuse me. Goodness. Um, Alright, so I'm just going to switch Veggie Burn out front because there are a bunch of biker guys. And the biker guys almost always use fighting types and poison. What's up, homie? Oh, well, that's too bad. You should take it to a shop and quit driving it so much. Ah, uh, biker Richard. Uh, see, poison types. Coffee. Copper. Alright, side beam. Melt its brain. <coughs> No big deal. No big deal. Mm, another coughing. Splat. And <clears throat> one more coughing. Probably one for the road. One little. Ooh, recover. I need that. Yes. <clears throat> recover will let me heal myself if things go wrong which is nice learn recover and then another poison type gonna melt that puddle of goo and, uh, and that's all she wrote on boys and girls on biker Richard did you burn gaining the level not bad not bad Oh, I feel like, hmm, I feel like that's not that bad for motorcycles, but maybe spokes are way wimpier than I thought. <clears throat> Clear the way or I'll run you down. Maybe don't ride your motorcycle on a bike, on a walking path. Yeah, in these games, the only, like, motorized transport you see are motorcycles and boats and maybe one truck if if you're lucky whereas in the other <clears throat> in the newer games there's planes and there's one uh um i want to say in black and white there's this highway that you have to go under <clears throat> so that's pretty cool uh, veggie burn's getting big off of all of this that's probably, that's probably fine. Alright, now I'm going, since I'm pretty sure that's all of the poison types down, I'm going to switch out to hero. And we're going to go fight these guys up here. Oh, yes, indeed you do look silly standing there. Lass, Megan, army of Pidgeys, huh? That's right. I'll just peck them to death good or not all right I guess I'll just rock throw them to death <laughs> like I don't okay so whirlwind out the Spiro but as soon as the onyx shows up you're just like perfect my plan is now activated go entire team of birds die for me I don't know 
don't know. So, Omix is a rock ground type, and he doesn't learn Earthquake naturally, which is a really, really kind of sad. He might learn it naturally in later gens, but he definitely doesn't for this one. A Meowth. Uh, rock throw. Yeah. Almost took it out. Those, the the reason why Bite is doing so much to me is because Bite is dark type, and technically in this game, dark type counts as a special move. And Nyx's special isn't great. Or, excuse me, special defense. And defense fell, but that's all. That's no big deal. Throw some more rocks. Gain a little bit more XP. And Pikachu won't have much that it can do to me either. <clears throat> I figured this lady would have nothing but Pidgeys. So I'm kind of glad I was wrong. I mean, they all still, still like went down just fine, but whatever, man. You're the one who challenged me. No, actually, I challenged you. I was wrong that time. Uh, heal you. I'm only down to 19 super soakers. All right, how much money? How many muns do I have? I've got enough. I've got enough to. Uh... What's up? Oh, okay, well, I suppose we're just going to fight now, <clears throat> Andrea, ooh, you are um, a little big for my tastes, so I'm just going to throw a rock type at it, and it's going to use bite, rock tune. Rock Tomb is probably gonna miss. Oh, I'm surprised it didn't. <clears throat> Screech. Screech. Mm, another bite. Stupid special moves, anyway. <clears throat> Let me guess. More Pidgey, or more Meowths. I don't know why I said Pidgeys. Screech again. Perfect. The nice thing about me opening up Saffron, like I did earlier, is I can go back to Cerulean at any time now. Because the whole reason I had to go through the Rock Tunnel is because that stupid guard in the gate was thirsty and he wouldn't let me through. Also, there's a couple really high-level trainers in Saffron. Like, there's a fighting type. I don't know. They're trying to be a gym, but they're not a gym. And you can get a level 25 or 30, like, unique fighting type from them. I, I say unique, but it's like, it's, it's a one-off that you can't get anywhere else in the game. And I'm probably going to pick up Hitbone Leaf from there because... Hitmonchan, <clears throat> I don't think is that great in this gen. Again, this gen uh, was before the the uh, special attack split. So uh, the big one of the big things about Hitmonchan was that Hitmonchan could learn all the elemental punches like Thunder Punch, Fire Punch, and Ice Punch, which was really good for like coverage. Um, but in this gen, it worked. They all ran off of his special stat, and fighting types don't have most fighting types, I should say, don't have great special attacks. <clears throat> and Hitmonchan definitely doesn't. Uh, are you a schoolboy? School is fun, but so is po so are Pokemon. I suppose. Yeah. All right. Oh, it's your super nerd. Super nerd Leslie. Super nerd Leslie used self-destruct. It's super effective. I was very sad. Ah, well. 
this is risky that I'm doing this because I'm worried he does have oh, sledge isn't that big a deal ow that hurt um that hurt a lot I'm gonna switch <clears throat> It's okay though, I should outspeed it. I should. Yeah, outsped it, gonna melt its brain. This is why I want a steel type. Because coughing and wheezing are absolutely terrifying to fight against. Because they're really durable and they. They're dumb. They're stupid. Ugh. Goodness, that was stressful. Uh, heal up all, heal up all the things. Um, you. Oh, okay. Do you like evolve them? Okay. Um, well, I think I'm going to switch to Veggie Burn and just melt, melt some brains. <laughs> oh, oh, I didn't know Nidoran female learned bite. The more you know. Confusion, melt its brain. Excuse me. All right. That's down. After a, a heart attack moment. Ah, oh, Knit Arena. Melted Sprain 2. I suppose it's nice that they get a Dark type move. <laughs> because they are weak against Psychic pretty... Oh, God, she's mad. What? Oh. Alright. Oh, this is a double battle. I think this is the first double battle I've had. So, double battle... Well, in this gen. There's two Pokemon on the field at once. And so, I'm going to... Focus on that Clefairy. Oh, well. I'm going to focus on that Clefairy regardless. Uh, even though Jigglypuff can put me to sleep, that would be annoying. But it would not be the end of the world. Oh no, it's cute charm. Oh no, it's rollout. Oh no. Okay, so hero's gotta go. Nyx is gonna switch in with hero. I'm lucky that that Jigglypuff attacked uh hero instead of jill attack missed uh, hopefully that'll just bounce okay good so rock rock our uh, rollout is a rock type move that does increased damage every every time it gets used and it locks you in for five turns and it hurts by the time it is all by the time that it's all said and done. That move is not something that you want to mess around with. Oh man, that was scary. You see, now it's doing bigger chunks to Nyx, and that's scary. Rock throw. Confusion. And down. Okay, good. That was far scarier than it needed to be. Twin power! Um, Alright, so after this... <coughs> Excuse me. After this... 
<clears throat> I'm going to go to the rocket hideout, and we're gonna we're gonna see what's going on in there. Are you a super nerd? You should be informed. Oh, okay. I'll need strategy besides just beat them down with my fists. Grimers. That's not cool, man. Um. I don't necessarily want Veggie Burn to take a hit, but if I have to, I'll, I'll use Recover, Heal, or something. Ouch. Huh? Ah, uh, mm, heal. Then he's gonna hit me again. Ah, disable. All right, good. I mean, I'm still poisoned, and that's still annoying, but it's okay. I'll probably just get poisoned again if I try to do anything else. So I'm just going to start hitting him. Ah, uh, so many people dropping into the red. That's just not cool. A muck. That is definitely not cool. I hate fighting mucks. So I mean, uh, goodness, that didn't take it out. Okay, good. And hurt by poison. Mm, confusion. I'm just glad it's not a toxic poison because there's a move called toxic that does like escalating damage when you get hit by it. That's stupid. Like, it does more and more of your health every round as the poison damage ticks away. 75 special attack. What do you got? Another Grimer. Okay. I can melt that. Boom. Wham. Alright, good. Good, good, good. It's not logical! Mm, antidote. Antidote down. Uh, super potion. Yeah. Super potion down. And one more trainer. Uh, cute, round, and fluffy. I would say Voltorb is cute. It is also round. It might be covered in tiny hairs, which would probably be not okay, but, you know, whatever. Peck! Oh, that didn't do... Oh, mm. Minimize. Peck! Missed. Great. See, this is what moves like Aerial Ace are built for. So you don't... Uh, and then it's Q charms too. Uh, so okay, so minimize makes it harder for me to hit them. Moves like aerial ace makes it impossible for me to miss. So that's why I want a hero or someone to have one. Oh, uh, really? Double slap, huh? Double slap hit four times. That double double slap came the center of attention. You just met her, man. Thank you. It's me or your trainer. Thankfully, Hero chose me. Another Cliff Berry. Alright, that thing's probably got cute charm also. Goop loop, you're up. Poison it, drink it, or cut it. Probably cut it. Poison it. Missed. Ouch. Ouch. Come on, poison it! Come on! Nope. Oh, come on. Come on! Yay, I poisoned it finally. Now I'm going to use Absorb just to get HP back. I would have been really salty if if that Sing had hit. Because um, Sing has a much lower 
uh, accuracy than poison powder. Uh, that was nothing. Jeez. I'm gonna try out cut next. Cut. Hiya. Oh, cut works way better. And then if if hero levels up from this, I'm going to use the rare candy that I might have. I can't remember if I've still got one to make him level 25, so he will learn uh, aerial ace and then let him evolve. I'm sorry, hero, you can't evolve yet. You can't be the big giant bird thing that you want to be. Bag. Rare candy. Well, it's elevated to level 25. Let's learn Aerial Ace. Yes. Uh, take away Fury Attack. And learned Aerial Ace. And he's evolving. Yay! To a giant bird. So Spiro's about the size of like, I don't know, maybe a basketball, maybe a smaller than that. And Firo, that it evolves into, is the size of a Cessna, more or less. It's just really big. It's big enough for people to fly on. So let's take a peek, see. Prevents loss of that. Yeah, so uh, his attack went up by a bunch. He's just really not not terrible now. Um, let's see. Yeah, he's he's got stats that are on par with my the rest of my team, which is nice because uh, he had the gentle nature and well, I don't know if that really affected anything, but he doesn't have didn't have great stats before, but now he's got mediocre stats, and that's all that matters. All right, guys. So next time I uh, will take on a rocket base together. And we will beat them, then go, I don't know, do other stuff. All right, guys. I'll catch you next time. Keep wandering. Don't get lost. Take care, guys.